Hey guys, it's John and welcome, welcome back to my YouTube channel. So, uh, Tyler Oakley made a video with uh, Jenna Ashkowitz and Kevin McHale about a year ago, and basically he quizzed the two uh, former Glee cast members on basically how well they knew the show. He, gave, he asked them questions about certain messy plot lines and then saw how well they knew the show. So I thought it'd be fun if I watched the video see the questions, I answer it, and then I see if, how, what, if they knew it, and then see if I knew the show better than the people on the show. Alright, so I have this video right here in front of me, and I'm just going to get it started. So, let's start with the first question. Let me actually fast forward to the actual questions. So let's see if you remember correctly. Okay. You can be boobadoo, you can be... We'll start easy. Okay, what did Finn name his burn sandwich? Oh, he made... He, <laughs> okay. What did Finn name his burn sandwich? This was in the second season. Not sure which episode. It was like... Grilled Jesus, I believe. Because his sandwich looked like Jesus. And then he started praying to the sandwich and all this stuff. So, I think <coughs> Grilled Jesus. I was gonna say that. It's well, too lost. easy. <laughs> Why did Blaine need surgery that suspiciously took him out of a few episodes? Why did Blaine need surgery that suspiciously took him out of a few episodes? Okay, so this was in season three, and he basically needed surgery on his eye because he got slushied. Slushy had rocks in it, so Sebastian threw the slushy at Blaine. Blaine um gets hit in the face, and there was rocks, and it like scratches his eye or something, so he needed surgery. Who sang the song, I'm Still Standing, and Why Did They Sing It? Okay. <laughs> okay. I honestly love this episode. Okay. So, in season 3, episode 16, I think it's the 16th, um, Quinn and Artie sing I'm Still Standing, um, because this is the first episode back when after Quinn gets in a car accident. She gets in a car accident because she's texting Rachel. She's texting her about where she is, and and then she is paralyzed, and she's put in a wheelchair, and she's like, oh. and here's gonna be me singing with my fellow wheelchair classmate, peer, whatever, friend, um, about how I'm still standing. <laughs> They're not standing. Artie and Quinn, because she is still What happens to Tina when she falls into a fountain? Okay, this is funny because Tina falls like so many times. But in the third season, Tina falls in a fountain. When she gets hit, when she hits her head and falls in the fountain, it's like there's like a dream sequence, and basically everyone is like switch places. Everyone has switched characters with someone else. So Tina is actually Rachel. Rachel is Tina, and so on and so forth. That happens. So everyone switch places. <laughs> Wait, doesn't it turn into a Friends-type episode? No! Oh no! I know what it is! I know what it is! She confuses everybody else for somebody else in the Glee Club, and she becomes Rachel Berry. You're thinking of the one where Sam hits me on the trophy and becomes Chuck. Why wasn't Sunshine in the New Directions? Why wasn't Sunshine Corazon in the New Directions? Oh my gosh, okay, Sunshine in New Directions. So this is season two, when they're trying to recruit new people, and this girl who was so talented, um, she was like so good and everyone loved her, right? But, but of course, Rachel feels threatened by her that she tells uh, Sunshine that she has to go to this crack house or something and then she doesn't join the New Directions, instead she joins the, the other Glee club at the other school, can't think of the name, but it was like a competing glee club, and so um, that's why she doesn't join the New Directions, because Rachel is 
the diva, she has to be the star, and she thought, oh no, if this girl joins, I'm not going to be the star. So she sent her to a crack house. She did. He dates Britney, because Britney will date anyone, and then they make out and stuff. Even though he's gay. Let's think through this. Okay. Wasn't Mercedes. Wasn't Mercedes. Wasn't Rachel Bear. Wasn't Rachel. It wasn't Quinn. It's to impress his dad. Oh, Britney. Oh, yeah, yeah, because to impress his dad. What trio made an iconic New York cover band? What trio made up an iconic New York cover band, and what was the band called? Um. Um. It was Santana, Kurt, and Rachel. Iconic New York trio. Um, and Adam Lambert. Were, what was it called, though? That's the thing I'm, I'm not sure what it was called. Oh, no. This is going to be the first one I get wrong. Um, oh, no. Okay, I know it was, like, some sort of, like, play on... Oh my gosh, this is gonna bug me now. I like know it, but I don't know it. Oh, I'm gonna. Okay. What was that band called? Was it Naya? Oh God. Sam. Wait. Wait. Demi was Kurt. the thing. Adam, Adam, Adam. And Demi. Yeah. 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 Well, they were in a cover band called One Three Hill. No. Oh, I was thinking that. Dang it. Okay, it was One Three Hill. But that was like for a second. That was not a big. What advice does Artie give Blaine and Rachel to improve their performance in West Side Story? Oh yeah, okay, so Blaine and Rachel are both virgins. And basically, Blaine and Rachel have to, you know, do it, so... Yep. Mm -hmm. What happens when Blaine is affected by a gas leak? What happens when Blaine is affected by a gas leak? Okay, first of all, this is when Glee, like, the writers are, like, a little crazy in the head. But, basically, everyone turns into a puppet. He sings a song with puppets. It was a mess. This is, this is iconic. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The puppets! Yes! I love that episode. I did. That was actually that. really fun. That's everybody's dream is to become a puppet. And then they never gave us a puppet. <laughs> <laughs> what does Quinn have a tattoo of and where? What does Quinn have a tattoo of and where? Quinn um, has a little meltdown and she has a tramp stamp, so that means it's like on your lower back. Um, and it's of Ryan Seacrest. Champs and what? It happened. It was what? Glee. Somebody wrote it. Somebody did it. It was a thing. Did that really air? Why, uh, why does Mercedes start a riot in the cafeteria? Why does Mercedes start a riot in the cafeteria? She starts a riot in the cafeteria. I don't keep up with Mercedes. I did not like Mercedes. I'm trying to think of all their riots. I mean, okay, I don't know this one. Oh no, that's not right. Tater tots? Maybe it was because of the tots. I know she liked the to her tot tater tots. I'm gonna say the tots thing, but I don't think it's not. That's it. Oh, is it? Yeah, that's it. Oh. oh. What about the tots? They stopped selling tater tots. Yeah. Oh. Okay. Sam tries to win back Quinn with a one-minute song that Oh my gosh, okay, Sam tries to win back Quinn with a one-man tribute band called the Justin Bieber Fever or something like that. It was something Justin Bieber, Justin Bieber. I didn't even know he was trying to win back when they together. I am obsessed with you. I am so disappointed in these two because I'm a little obsessed, but let's be honest. 
the Justin Bieber experience. Justin Bieber experience, okay. I kind of... This one's easy. What was the name of the acapella group Mr. Shu made? Okay, so they already are about to answer it, so I'm going to stop it there before he um, actually says it. But, what was the name of the a cappella group Mr. Shu uh, made with McKinley teachers? Um, it was called a cappellas. So. And that's... You didn't buzz in, you cheater. I give you both a point. Okay, Yay! you both really need it. This is good because we're so bad. This is really bad. How many episodes were there total? A hundred? How many episodes? Oh! Okay, so I know the hundredth episode. Okay, so I know the hundredth episode of Glee was like the thirteenth episode of season five. So there's that. There's thirteen episodes in season six, so that's one hundred and thirteen plus the remaining season five, which thirteen, and then they they have twenty two episodes, so nine. Plus 13. 122? Approximately, approximately 122 episodes. No! That's me. I was so close. Um, I think I knew a lot more than them. Um, editing Jenna will tally it up right here and see how many I got. But... Uh, it's, I think it's safe to say I know a little more than, um, Kevin McHale and Jen Ashkowitz, actual cast members of the, the show Glee. Uh, yeah. Anyways, I hope you guys this enjoyed this video. If you liked it, give it a thumbs up. Comment down below how well you knew Glee, um, if you participated in this as well. Um, I'll link the original video down below. And make sure to subscribe and hit the bell notification so you're notified whenever I upload a new video. See you guys in the next one. Bye! Thank <laughs> you.